Okay, so last night, after getting back to the root house, things have gone kind of weird for everybody. Um, after finding a startling <laughs> note on our door. We, we found all kinds of weird stuff when we get back from the airport. Okay, so should we explain the Phoenix airport thing too, just so this isn't like a 10 second video? Maybe. His flight, his flight was late. So, okay, so. It's a good way to explain it. It, it was. No, he's so now it's going to be a 12 it, second video. It actually was late. No, no, I'm going to talk about us being lost and oh, yeah. thinking it was a missing person. Yeah. Okay. So we get to the airport. I get there like two hours before Drewby and Katz. And then um, I'm waiting at their baggage claim. And they almost didn't come to the baggage claim at all because they didn't have any luggage. I just assumed Phoenix would be there with all his like suitcases and stuff. And... Uh, they were gonna ditch me. Like, the cats was like, let's go, he'll meet us there. But my car was the one at the garage, so. Yeah, don't worry, Josh. That would have been dumb. I didn't let him ditch you. I would have been dumb for you guys, because I, I would have been fine. I would have waited 20 more minutes and gone to your house, but um, I didn't have a key to their house, so I just, you know, waited at the airport, and we drove there together, so I assumed we would drive back, but. Anyway, Phoenix was supposed to land before me, and I, had, I didn't know that. I thought Phoenix was with them. Phoenix doesn't have a phone. Katz lost his phone. So we had no communication with Phoenix. We had no idea if he was in the airport or at the house, outside on the porch, like waiting for us to get there or what. And then we kind of got saved because Phoenix actually landed at like 10.30 p.m. Yeah. And six hours late. Yeah, like six hours late <laughs> after we had already left the airport and come back to the house looking for him. So finally we got in touch with him via his brother and his girlfriend and a bunch of other people, but are you going to get destroyed? No, it's, there's no charge anymore. Okay. Um, Sorry, I interrupted your story. Uh, but anyway, we finally got in touch with him and he took a cab to the house, but the house isn't on GPS or some stupid thing. So <laughs> the cabbie waited with Phoenix in the parking lot of a Burger King for like 20 minutes for us to go get him. It was very weird. It was like 1130 at night when we first saw Phoenix. So yeah. finally, at least we were a bit relieved that... Uh, he wasn't a missing person. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. Oh, but um, when we were going to go to the Burger King to pick up Phoenix, Katz offered to drive his car, which is not here. If he does a lap around, that'll be oh, that'll be good for the video if he does actually come back. I told him to do a lap around here because if his car breaks down, we'll have to put it in neutral and drag it back here. Oh. So if he goes too far, then he's he's messed up. But anyway, Katz's battery was totally totally dead. He couldn't unlock the door with oh, there's there's Katz's car rolling by there hopefully he hopefully he comes back but um yeah well you could see it in the distance but um yeah his battery is super dead so we just took my car and now this morning or i guess it's around noon that's when i woke up uh we came out here and jumped his his uh, car battery but none of us had ever done it before uh Katz is like josh you got this i was like um i'll see if i have cables and luckily i did because my dad cares enough to put a car care kit in my uh, trunk. So I had these cables and I was like, they've never been used. Like, look, they're shiny, they're shiny. Brand new jumper cables from like five years ago. And thank God they have that little white piece of paper there with instructions on it, because Drewby didn't know. I didn't know. Cats went inside and watched a YouTube video and was like, I'm an expert now. Yeah, so, I people are gonna laugh at us. I don't know, man. Oh my God, they're so smart, it's, they jump the cars. Yeah, but it's just like, we've never done it before. It's not like a, I don't know, something that's never come up in my life. But uh, Cats is back and his car works. <laughs> okay, yeah, so that's why my my hood is up and Katz was driving around and that's our story for uh, the that's first day cool back. That's our story, dude. First full day back yeah. from Dallas, Texas, so hope you guys enjoyed that. I'll make a couple more videos today if something interesting happens. All right. Maybe if Phoenix gets in a fight with Katz or Drewby, I'll, I'll be able to get the camera fast enough, but uh, I'll, see you, I'll see you later, YouTube.